Hey guys, welcome back to Freak Motion. In today's video, we are going to create a digital scan text reveal animation inside of After Effects. From start to finish, everything you saw in the preview, I am going to create that inside of After Effects. No use of third-party plugin. So without wasting any more time, let's jump into the After Effects and let's get started. First, create a composition with normal settings. Give it a name you like. Now take the type tool and type a text you like. Adjust the size and align it to the center. After that, recompose the text layer. Double click on the rectangle shape tool to get a shape layer. We need to animate this shape. On one second, add a keyframe on the scale property. Then come back to first frame and change the scale value to zero. This is simple scaling animation. Adjust the keyframe if needed. On the shape layer, add an effect called turbulent displace. Apply it on the layer. Change the amount value to 200. And change the size value to 50. Also increase the complexity value to maximum value. Hold Alt and click on the stopwatch icon to add an expression on the evolution option. Then type time multiplier 50. On the same layer, add another effect called mosaic. Change the both block values to 50. Or we can make this horizontal block value to 100 so that we can get perfect square pixel just like this after that change the track mat of the text layer to alpha mat so we can get this kind of animation select both layers and pre-compose it again let's call it text reveal On this layer, add a fill effect and change the color to white. Select the layer and press Ctrl plus D to make a duplicate. And offset the top layer by 5 frames. And change the track map of the layer to alpha inverted map. I am using 2023 version, so I have to check mark this box to get the alpha inverted option. But other versions, you can do it easily from this panel. We can see some outlines there, and to get rid of that, we are going to apply an effect called minimax. Change the operation to minimax and change the radius value to 1. Also change the channel to alpha and color. Now we can see there are no outlines there. Select both layers and pre-compose it. Let's call it text scan. Bring the text reveal layer on the timeline. On the top layer, add an effect called CC Glass. Here, change the softness value to 1, hide value to minus 50, and displacement value to 200. Also, change the property to alpha. Now we can see the effect on the text. On the same layer, add an effect called displacement map. Change the max vertical displacement value to 0 and change the max horizontal displacement value to 100. Duplicate the layer one more time by pressing Ctrl plus D and change the horizontal displacement value to minus 200. These two effects are optional, you can use it or not, it's your choice. 
all right let's make it colorful for doing that let's add an effect called color roma at the same time change the top layer blending mode to screen now open input face and change this one to text scan layer you can change the color tone from here and here you can find lots of color preset that you can use it if you wish to let's skip the hue cycle for now open modifier option and turn off the modify alpha and at the end let's add some glow effect on the text scan layer you can change the values according to your need or you can just make another copy of the glow effect to make it more brighter just like this let's add a solid layer for background place it at the bottom and apply gradient ramp effect on it change the color according to your composition and your animation is ready you can change the text anytime you want or you can use any logo instead of the text so this is all for today i hope you like the video thanks for watching see you guys in the next video till then have fun and stay safe